Hello, this is Citrus Druid XCDX, and I'm going to be talking about Stealth RG's Chips uh, Season 4. Uh, I don't know what exactly he calls it. I don't think he has a title for it at all. Uh, but I'm going to be talking about why it had to happen and what can happen in the future in Season 5, which they might just stray away from the whole land beer thing entirely, even though he's hinting at it. Um, I think it's probably not possible for him to re, re go back to it but maybe if they become friends I don't think it'll ever be like a love, love interest again I don't know how he would be able to do it just because of why he did what he did for the ending and if you guys don't know the ending um, I'd highly recommend watching the VODs um, before I talk about it because there's spoilers um, I'm going to be have huge spoilers for this uh it's a great series he might start uploading more of his youtube stuff he has a guy doing all that um for him and he's only had like two videos two or three videos up at the moment of this recording um so you're gonna have to wait till a while for them and you're gonna miss a lot not a lot lot but like funny moments that are just you know there but uh i'm sure people if you go to his um discord you can find out how to watch all of the all the vods in order where sometimes some days he has off days so hopefully they'll tell you how to skip those and stuff um but three i want to talk about the ending and maybe even a little bit more of what they could do for season five it's just me speculating um as a fan um i like to speculate um maybe even put in some input not like not script but like maybe put in some more to plot development they are doing preseason right now which i don't think it's preseason because they're introducing a new character which is izzy and she has so much plot development and uh, character development that it's it's not preseason it's it it's more or less like just introducing a character but heavily introducing for what i'm seeing um, and I, I, I have more speculation on her later because, but I, I want to talk more about season five or uh, four, and then I have heavy, heavy speculation for her, uh, something later, but season four, uh, why they had to do the ending. So if, like I said, watch the VOD if you, I'm going to spoil everything. Uh, so why they had to do it was because if you guys don't know the, the ending, they had to just do a soft reset, which there's the whole point. They had the cycles where they can either go forward and I think they can go forward, but they can go back in time and just change something. Um, or even, even differently, you can have characters not be there gone. It's just the way they had to do it is because if they didn't, then there would be a whole like weird attitude within the community because it's because both groups rp and the only reason they're together the uh joey bagels and lanfear were together they're they are if they, that kept going they would straight up not talk to each other in rp because who the fuck actually like talks to a girl that cheated on you it's cheating i know it's hard to say I love Lamphere, like, but it is cheating. Um, but it's it's cheating. You, you just don't talk to a girl after that. It's once you break up, you just don't talk to them anymore. And it's just, I know they could talk out of RP, but they needed to do this reset. And it sucks that Chips is the downfall, but he was the one that did kind of go on in on a, another man's girl, but. I understand love is love, but it, it had to go down that way. I don't know how, I don't think it's entirely possible for him to ever have Lamphere, like, in a romantic relationship, because it would do the exact same scenario, unless you changed it in a way where, because I don't think, I think Lamphere really would rather be with Joey just because that's how they've been there with each other a lot longer and I feel like she was kind of I don't want to say forced but because I feel like she did like 
doing the RP, but she was forced into being in the RP with him. I don't want to say forced though. I don't know how what word to say. But I feel like she was pushed pushed to do RP with him. Um, even though it was a great story, like I loved it entirely way through. I watched every single one episode at night, and I'm just it was so I I, I loved it. I, I want I want the YouTube videos to be up, um, but. I just don't see a way for him to ever have the so-called spark <laughs> again with Lamphere. And I think that's why they're implementing Izzy, but I, <sighs> Izzy is a weird character. I will talk, <sighs> all right, I'm gonna start talking about that. Izzy is a weird character because I feel like this is what I want to th think. She's a human. She says she's human. That's hundred, hundred, couple hundred years old. That's what they're saying. I haven't watched all of the uh, recent ones just because slow RP. I, I don't really want to watch it. And then they're mostly they're doing it after the Sora RP, which I like the Sora RP, but I'd rather just watch the VOD of the Sora RP with a uh, Seven because Seven's doing all the work for this. Uh, I love Seven. Seven's great and sci-fi it's like everybody i love everybody in the group and core and stuff but uh seven's been doing really really good on the sore rp um, but as i was saying with izanabi i feel like she's i don't get me wrong she's a succubus i know that's like weird you could say a non-conventional succubus where she might not like you know, do the dir dirty deeds to to get her souls because she says she gets souls, right? Am I right? She might have said this. I just haven't watched all of the recent RP, but I feel like she's a succubus because she's tempting uh, Chips to like him and also trying to manipulate him to become make her become a vampire, which I feel like she. If she did that, I don't know how that would work with the succubus because I've never looked into the lore. But if a uh, vampire fucking bit a succubus, I feel like it wouldn't kill them. That's why she knows she wouldn't die, and she because she knows she's dying. Um, her character is so maybe she wants to live forever because she knows she won't die from his bite. Um, this is just all speculation for me because she hasn't wanted to say what her character is. She says she's human, and I know that's lying, and I know uh, Chip slash Stealth fucking hates uh, lying in general. But you gotta lie sometimes in RP to have a good story, and I feel like as a succubus, they always lie that and say that they're human, even though they're not. Um, just because that's in their nature. Uh, but yeah, I feel like you could do so much more with that uh, in the timelines. Because they really, they're trying so hard to like uh, get information that Chips does not remember. But apparently Izanabi knows. Maybe they already have something in the background that they both know. But... Uh, I feel like it would help out a lot more if we knew she was a succubus because it feels like she's a succubus. She gets souls. How do the fuck? How are you human and get souls unless you're like a hunter? Um, and she's ha she can get desire out of people, which uh, that's what succubus does. It could be an unconventional succubus. You know what I mean? Like she doesn't have to do it in uh, the sexual means, but. I'm just saying they went to jail. <laughs> uh, friends with benefits, maybe. Uh, and she and I also watched recently. She, I'm just watching clips about it. She says uh, that just kiss me and do it already with the biting of of the stuff. And I feel like it's temptation from a succubus. And it's it. I think it's good RP. Uh, it's a it's a good character that I've never seen in the RP in this RP that 
would be a great implement Im implementation because she does have powers I, I don't know if they said how she has her powers but a succubus would make sense to me um, but like I said uh, I know we're rambling but this, this is what it is it's just fucking rambling. Um, I and I, I'm hyped for season five. I, it is preseason mainly because of the, the club being built, and they're just doing character development. And Sora RP is really good. I just don't watch the actual fucking live streams because I got work, and I'd rather watch uh, the main RP. And main RP is after Sora RP, and that's late. So. All right, if you guys like the video, make sure to like it. Remember, I say we're in such most of the If you guys like my theories, space, space, fucking hit that like button. Oh yeah, I also want to say um, maybe, maybe the way that they could implement him losing his memory is he lost his memory because of cycles again. I don't know. I don't really want to go back to cycles. Let's be honest, fucking honest. Shit was fucking. Uh, but yeah. Mercy words, most of words. I'll see you guys next video.